sound in water. Sound is a wave pressure. That is a very rapid increase in pressure, which is transmitted from a molecule to those near it. In a vacuum, where there are no molecules, sound is not transmitted. In air, however, sound can be transmitted. However, each molecule must move closer to the others to raise the pressure. And as you already know, the molecules and gases are far apart. If instead the distance between them is small, as in the case in solids and liquids, to transmit the pressure wave, each molecule travels a shorter distance, but the total number of molecules to be moved is greater. This means that in water, sound propagates faster than it does in the air, but in order to be audible, it must have greater power. Our brain, even if at a conscious level we do not realise it, manages to distinguish the direction of origin of a sound in the air by analysing the delay with which it reaches the two ears. Since sound travels about four times faster in water than it does in the air, this delay is so small that a noise always seems to come from in front of us, from whichever way we turn our heads. When you are just below the surface, be very careful if you hear the sound of a boat. Its dangerous propeller could be very close, but you will have difficulty in identifying the direction the sound is coming from.